Raven Rutherford, owner of Blackbird Pies, joins us in our Builder Source kitchen this morning. And I must say that Raven puts her personal touch on pies <laughs> and specialty cakes from old family recipes. Welcome back. You're kind. Thank you. Glad to be back. We're always <laughs> happy when you're here. And I want to ask you, what sweets and treats do you dish up at Blackbird Pies for those who don't know? Well, of course, I do the vinegar pie, sweet potato pie, coconut custard, uh, blackberry rhubarb, which is one of my signature pies, oh, strawberry yeah. rhubarb, pecan, quiches. And uh, we had some of your pecan pie the other day when we talked about the big thing coming up, the big chocolate festival yes. coming up for a balloon museum. So that's exciting. That was my British pecan pie. Actually, that's Ooh, what I'm going good. to make this morning. Well, and you know, you also, I want to mention, create desserts that are for customers who might want something a little more unusual or even for those who have allergies or special dietary needs. So yes. let's tell them about that. I do gluten-free and sugar-free pies. Um, right. Also, for cancer patients uh, that can't have um, certain um, mm -hmm. dairies or eggs or different things. So all my pies are made from scratch yeah. and so I can customize for whatever dietary need a person That's has. That's so wonderful, Raven. And, and you also do catering services. Let's talk about that for those who are uh, looking for it. Yes. The holidays, I do dinners. Right around the corner. I do breakfasts. Um, breakfast burritos, I do quiches, full course sit down meals, whatever you'd like. You know, people are coming in for Balloon Fiesta. They might want some party, they might have some parties, they need some catering, they might want to take some stuff back to where they come from. So you're the one. I'm the one. You're the one. I'm so raising how, my hand. How are you going to ruin my diet today, Raven? Well, um, I'm making the pie that Dean Strober bought good. on Monday, and good. that's my British pecan pie. Oh, good. And so we're going to. Uh, Get started with that. Yes, please okay. show us how the magic is made. All I know right. you always keep a few secrets from us because <laughs> family recipes, yes. I know that goes. Well, what we're going to do is we're going to add one cup of, um, of brown sugar. Okay. And then we're going to add one cup of dark K roll syrup. Woo! That looks and very good. Yes. This and definitely to that, wanted to work out after, but we're going you, know, to add you only live once. <laughs> and one, two teaspoons of vanilla. Oh, it smells so good. We're going to add. Can yeah. you grab the butter from out of the? You might need a little hot pad. It's in the oven. Oh, it's in the oven. Yes. Okay. It's melting a bit. In at the top. At the, at the very bottom. Look at the very bottom. Oh, there it is. Yes, I do need a hot pad. Yes. Thank you. And also to that. It's not coming out though because it's. This is. I need like an actual. Uh, <laughs> I can tell who's not kitchen friendly. I really actually am, I swear. Are you? But it wasn't on the rack. <laughs> no, because it'll fall through. Here's the thing. Okay. I'm a great cook, but I'm really okay, bad at burning myself. In there. It's really hot. Where do we want to pour it? In here? Just pour it right in there. Hot butter coming our way. Mm -hmm. Whoop. <gasps> Sizzling. Mm -hmm. We want to get all that deliciousness Ooh. out of that out of that, tray. that is a hot little silver cup. Mm. Oh, wow. Okay, okay, that just changed everything. The smell and then now, to, oh my God. And then to that, we're going to add a cup and a half of pecans. Mm, 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 mm. And then, okay, we're going to continue to stir this yes. bit. And then on the bottom of, of our prepared pie crust, I'm sorry so I didn't make the uh, dough on camera, but That's we're limited okay. for time. You do normally make your own dough though, right? Yes. Okay. We're going to pour a fourth of a cup of bitter chocolates. Ooh. And we're going to have them kind of scantily around in there, so okay. it doesn't have to be in every Spread out nice. yeah in every corner. Okay. Okay. And then we're going to pour our filling over the bitters. Nice. And you have a British background, which is why I we're do. doing this British pecan. Yes. And I'm giving away a few of my little secrets. I love your secrets. <laughs> <laughs> you just love to eat the secrets. I do. I love to eat the secrets. I can't lie. <laughs> and then when it comes out of the oven, we're going to pour um, uh, half an ounce. Well, actually, it's an ounce and a half of VSOP brandy, oh. as I have here, over the top. That's a good secret. So we're going to pop this in the oven at 350 okay. for 35 to 40 minutes, depending on how quickly your oven Bakes. bakes. Now, so, okay, 350, 35 to 40 minutes or so. What do we want to look for? I mean, what's the answer? Because I'm just not a good baker. I'm not. I'm a good cook, but not a good baker. So what's what's the answer? When we look at that pie, what do we want to look for? Well, to know what you want to make certain is, well, on, on the pecan pie, it'll uh -huh. be just a little, uh, a little gelastic. Okay. Because that's the nature mm. 
of it. Okay. Um, and so you want to make certain that it is done. You can, and if you're nervous, you can just take a toothpick and uh -huh. stick it in. So you pull it out and it's dry. Even That's though it may be test. still gelastic, and what I mean it still might be moving, it's still okay. Right. As and long as that, it pulls out clean. Because we want that crust to be golden and crispy, but we don't want to burn. That's, no, you no. don't. You and then just kind of put it in your oven and never too hot. Okay, never yeah. too hot. I, never I, too I agree hot. with that. And I also want to remind our viewers that you are going to be at that big Top Chocolate Festival this weekend at Balloon Museum. So real quickly, let's tell them how you're involved. Um, actually, I'm a vendor at the Big Top Chocolate Festival, mm -hmm. and I will be displaying and selling my wares. I'm doing a, um, a chocolate mint lemonade. Ooh. I'm also doing um, chocolate pecan pie peanut butter chocolate pie, oh my. some parfaits full of chocolate, of course. Do you know, there's nothing like chocolate uh, for relaxing and, right? and curing whatever ails you. I can't argue with that, Raven. I can't argue with it at all. <laughs> and the, you know, and I tell people, in this economy, the best thing we can do for ourselves is spend time with loved ones and close friends and eat well. Oh, I love you. This, see, I knew we would be friends the day we met. How can people get a hold of you? 505 205 Seven seven three five is my direct number. Okay. I'm also on the New Mexico Growers Market website. Also, you can just Google me, mm. Raven Rutherford or Blackbird Pies. Fabulous. Well, of course, very easy to get a hold of you, and we love when you're here. Now, is this the chocolate peanut butter one you were talking about? Yes, and actually, we're going to finish <gasps> topping that with the whipping cream that you saw me whipping at the uh, beginning of our segment. Oh my God, does that sound good? Okay, so when we come back, we will put on the whipping cream and we will take out our final pie and we will taste the best part of all. Absolutely. I can't wait, we'll be right back. Thank you. <laughs> mm. And of course we are here with Raven Rutherford who is making us delicious pecan pie and you also have your chocolate peanut butter pie with all the yes. delicious oh whipping cream. This looks so good, should we go for the pecan first? Yeah. I think we should Let's go for the it. pecan. Let's do it, let's do it. Oh my gosh, this looks like heaven. I'm so confident that it's gonna be delicious as oh, it always yeah. is. Have a oh, wonderful yeah. day, everybody. If there's anything you need to know about today or any of our shows, log on to our website at casa.com. We'll see you tomorrow morning.